Are you bored because your dad won't let you play video games? I know. How about a Nerf gun? Now, what are we going to shoot with it? Your brother? Your dog? Your mother? I guess not. Well, what can I shoot? Now, after watching this video, you'll be able to make your very own Nerf Dart Target Stand in several, many, very complicated steps. You can make your own Target Stand. To make your Nerf Gun Target Stand, you may need something to mark with, something to measure with, and something to cut with. Something else to cut with. And some tape. And duct tape. And an eight pound sledge. To start making your super awesome Mega Nerf 3000 shooting gallery of the champions box, you start with a regular box. You could use a large box or a small box or a medium box such as this. First thing you want to do is find a box that has a flappy end. This is very important. Once you have a flappy end box, lay the box down. Find the two seams. One flappy end, back flappy end. Start on this corner and draw a line from this corner to this flappy end side using some sort of straight edge. After you make your line, now you're ready to start your cut. Start on the open end and go all the way to the seam. Make sure you have a nice sharp blade. Now that your cut's made there, focus on the front. Decide if you need these front tabs. I would suggest not, because you want this flap to free swing in between the box. Now, use whatever method you feel is necessary to cut the, the side tabs off. We decided to only cut half of the tabs so that it would be more stable on the ground. As far as the back tabs go, keep those in place, because we're gonna use duct tape to tape them together. Keep the box stable while you're, while you're shooting at it. The next thing to do is mark out your targets, whether you want to make circle targets or square targets. I prefer square targets. They seem to be a little easier to do. You can use a straight edge and trace it, or you can do it by freehand. I usually do it by freehand. I just come in about two inches or so, make little tabs. Same thing on the other side. These tabs are what the targets are going to swing on. Then create the shoulders. Bring this straight across all the way to the side, connect them, and then I draw a line down the center to make it easy. There. Now, once you have that done, get something to cut on, and go ahead and make your cuts. To cut your actual targets, I prefer a finer instrument, such as a utility knife. You may find that you might just need to go outside and use a larger instrument to get this done. Once you've made your cuts, you should have two tabs that freely swing like this. Pull the pack tab down and the two side tabs on top of it. Once the duct tape is secure, your very own Super Nerf 3000 Shooting Gallery of the Champions League Gallery. <laughs> Nerf style for shooting. Made out of cardboard. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Please enjoy this video. If you like the instructions on how to make this, please like or thumbs up or whatever social media thing you'd like to do. Twitter or Instagram. Twitter. Cloud or something like cloud that. Cloud or something. <laughs> To let people know, even though you're probably the only one that's ever going to see it. Thanks. Kid, goodbye.